Me are the original junglist from 19 what year, yeah, sir. Can't get the them lock up. Freedom, youngster. There is no original more original than this. Yo, yo, welcome back. Kingslayer Gaming coming at you from PCWAZ. I got my main man, the flyest athlete across the independent professional wrestling scene. I'm talking about my man, Flyboy Freddy. How you doing, baby? Feeling good, man. Feeling pretty good about yourself. Oh, dude, I'm not as high as you right now. And trust me, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? Yo, Freddy has been lighting the independent professional world on fire. I just came out of this PCWAZ show out here going Broadway, baby. Yo, and Mesa AZ tearing it down. I didn't hear a single person screaming louder than when Freddy, my man, was in the ring, baby. How does it feel to have an entire ring and building screaming your name? Man, it's a feeling like no other. It's something you, you dream about, you know. I've something I've wished for when I was a kid, and just to have that, man, it's just the coolest feeling ever. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't change it for anything. I don't care if it's one person, five people, or even no one. Still, it feels great. Dude, and it, it's inspiring just to watch you because when you jump from the middle rope, top rope, outside, you know, doing your thing like only you can. How do you get that emulate? Like, who do you emulate when you go and do your training? Like, who's some of the guys that you like? You know what? I like that move. I want to do it. Like, is it like a video game for you? You add into the move set. Talk to me. How you make Freddy Freddy? Man, I get a lot of inspiration from guys like let's see, Rob Van Dam, Jeff Hardy, Super Crazy, Rey Mysterio, all these guys, man. All these high flyers I grew up watching. I just I wanted to be them, and I wanted to pay somewhat of a tribute to them you know what i'm saying man i love it my man is out here for the folks and making sure he pays back to the legends that paved the way my man is about it i love it so talk to me a little bit about going into the tag team division now because i know when i was watching you you were more of the singles wrestler you know going through getting your cutting your teeth you know in triple threat matches my man was throwing it down as underdog freddy you know what i'm saying that's what we nicknamed you back on the joint but I just wanted to know, going into the tag team with Devin Reno now, how does it feel to be a tag team wrestler? Is it different? Is it more of the same? Talk to me. Man, at first, it felt different. I was, you know, I didn't know what to expect, but, I mean, we were the first ever PCWAZ tag team champions, and we are still on that hunt. We are still going after those titles, and we won't stop until we have those titles. So it feels pretty damn good, actually, you know? I mean... He and I were both super athletic. We both thrive off each other, so it's, you know, it's like a perfect mix. I love it. I love it. A nice complimentary of strength and power is a classic recipe, baby, and it works, baby. Why are we changing it if it works? I know what you know what I mean. Yo, so talk to me a little bit going forward because I don't want to take up too much of your time, but I know you got another show next month. What's going next? Are you guys going to be pursuing more tag team gold? Are you going to be trying to go more into a singles joint for a little bit? Like, is there a little peek behind the curtain we can see with Flyboy? All I know is that in June, Phoenix Fan Fusion, you will see me there. That's all I'm going to say. Yo, hey. Yo, my man is going to be there. Phoenix Fan Fusion. That's going to be going on. In Yo, y'all need to be out here. That's also going to be a Mesa, correct? That's going to be a Mesa, correct. Yo, y'all got to be there. Phoenix Fan Fest. I know y'all about it. So, my man, Freddy, I just got one more question for you because I, I don't want to take up too much. My man is flying through the skies. My man's got places to be. You know what I'm saying? He's going f faster than the planes. You know what I mean? He's out here just doing his thing. So, when you have a generation, and I'm talking generations, I saw not only grown adults cheering, I saw children cheering, I saw old men cheering. Like, you got generations of people behind you. Is that something that you go purposefully where you try to adapt to every single, like, individual out there? Like, you try to speak to it? Or are you just you, baby, and everybody just love Flatboy Freddy? I'm just me, and, you know, for everyone that supports me, believes in me, everything I do is for them and them only. I love it, bro. I love it, man. Anything else you want to say out here to the fans that, you know, follow you, watching you? Because I saw these little kids. You should have saw the look in their ass, Freddie, when they saw you going through the air, bro. I'm just saying, bro, I've never seen a more inspired little girl. So talk to me, dog. 
what are what's some message we can give out to these kids that are fans of professional wrestling that use it as a positive outlet in the world, dog? If you put your mind to something, if you work hard enough, it will come. It takes time, but it will come. And also, feel free to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at flyboy underscore freddy. Yo, my man is out here flying through it. That's what I'm talking about. So until next time, this has been your boy, Flyboy Freddy, straight out of PCWAZ. Going live at Broadway, son. Your boy, John Johnson. You know what it is.